In 1949, Uptown Sports Club opened as a neighborhood spot on the east side for locals to drink, bet, and watch games. It's recently been reimagined and reopened for the community to enjoy today. And that's where we find Tierra Newbaum live. Good morning, Tierra. Good morning, you guys. We've been talking about mental health awareness this morning. We started on Town Lake. We made our way to the east side Uptown Sports Club. Joined by Aaron Franklin, and uh, oh, hey we're there. sipping on, hey, good morning, sipping on some cappuccinos and lattes and coffees and Yeggers, whatever else. Top and of the morning to you. Tell us about Uptown Sports Club, coffee and all the things. Yeah, so we opened up Uptown Sports Club, oh, God, I guess about seven weeks ago now, and uh, opened 8 a.m. to 2 a.m. every day but Tuesdays. And uh, get into coffee in the mornings, get into uh, po' boys and gumbo for lunch, get into cocktails and happy hour for the happy hours, and then get into dinner at night, more cocktails. Community is important to you guys, and I think that's, for some people, that, that this is their place to get away, and, and we're talking about that mental health awareness. You guys want to build a community here. Can you talk about that? Well, we are part of a community here, and really the... You know, like any good restaurant or any little spot, you know, you just always feel it's kind of like cheers. Love it. Just go in. Uh, it's kind of like the water cooler conversation. You know, you go in, you see the same people every day. You always have a place to go hang out, Absolutely. kind of a meeting spot for the neighborhood. So, yeah, we're super excited to be over here. This building's been here since the 1800s and, and really, you know, more about the more than even the food for this place. It's really just about a cool building and just a really great neighborhood. Yeah, well, can you tell us a little bit about what made this come back to life? It had been vacant for years and years and years. Um, and, uh, you know, I, it was built in the uh, in the mid to late 1800s. We're not exactly sure when, uh, but it been a whole bunch of different things. Sports bar in the late 40s, Uptown Sports Club in the 60s, 70s, 80s. And then we just kind of kept the name and polished off the brick and built a whole bunch of stuff inside. It's a vibe. It is fantastic here. All right. I think we got some food coming in. And we have... <laughs> Gumbo for breakfast? Uh, breakfast gumbo. How about? Sausage gumbo and an Uptown Sports Club. A little bit of Franklin's Welfare. Thank you, good Thank sir. Thank you so much. Okay, yeah, can you walk us through what we got here? Yeah, so this is a uh, one of the po' boys. Now, it's not quite lunchtime yet, but we were able to sneak this one out. Thank you. Because you it's cold. I was hungry. Um, so every good sandwich shop should have a club. Uh, but this mm -hmm. one is the sports club. Is it ready yes, for it's me to dig play. in? Yeah, heck yeah, dig right in. Um, wow. Okay, so then you've got, oh, look at this. How about a latte in a club at Uptown Sports Club yeah. for breakfast? Oh, well, and, looky here. Uh, Just a little oh, splash of hot sauce, please too. Please give me some hot sauce. I'm always in for that. What else is on the menu? You guys have some fun plans. I'm going to ask you the question before I take the big bite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, take a big bite. So we've got gumbo all day we got four po boys on the menu fried shrimp uh, hot roast beef the sports club and uh, we've got a fried green tomato for a veggie one yes you can add bacon um, we've got a full raw bar so you get oysters crab louis smoked trout dip all that kind of stuff definitely adding more to that and then once we get into nighttime stuff here in a couple weeks we're gonna be adding the rest of the menu which is more of a brasserie kind of thing so I have like steak frites grilled fish uh, we have some rad fries on the menu that aren't on the menu we have a burger that we're running as a special right now that's not quite on the menu yet, but it will be very soon. So, yeah, it's kind of, you don't really open a restaurant with everything. You just kind of stage it out. And, like, we just built these bars this morning. And, you know, it's a constant work in progress. Well, that's what's fun is people can co keep coming back, keep having something new. You don't do anything halfway. So this is all absolutely phenomenal. Aaron, well, thanks for joining us. I do what we can. Cheers. Cheers. Guys. It is a beautiful looking restaurant. That bar is oh, it's stunning bar is in really here. Cool. Yeah. And this Food is looks so great. Good. Yeah, enjoy, Tierra. Yeah. Good to see Aaron Franklin. So you can use thank, both thank hands. Thank you. There we go. Look at this. <laughs> mm. As we say, breakfast of champions. Thank you, Tierra.